Hello everybody and welcome back to some more shenanigans in Sneaky Sasquatch. My name is of course Constantine and we are back at the museum right up here. Uh, in the previous episode we actually managed to finish up building up the museum. Uh, we had to bring some more lumber in order to help these guys finish up the museum. Unfortunately we cannot really use this to fast travel here but who knows, maybe in the future once we are done with uh, collecting all the bones from the research site right over here, maybe we are going to be able to do it. Now, the thing is, in order for us to uh, be able to uncover some bones in the dig site here, we're actually going to have to increase our puppy a little bit. Uh, let's see, can I actually uh, give him a little bit of pet here? No, so we are not improving. We are not increasing his uh, experience here, unfortunately. So, let me just make my way a little bit back home here, get some sleep, restart the day, and then we are going to be able to keep on increasing our puppy. I think uh, we are kind of really close to be able to do this. So, let me get myself some sleep. There we go. I love it that the puppy is actually following us and going in his bed as well. That is so good. All right, puppy, new day. Let's keep uh, let's keep on rolling here. Now our Sasquatch here is dressed up as a constructor because I thought it was funny to have Sasquatch building up the museum. Uh, without us, they would have never been able to do it. Uh, let me also feed up our puppy. If we have some food for him. Let's see. Oh, we definitely have. There you go, buddy. Love it. Look at that. All right, we got some more foodie here. Here we go, we got some more food in here. And I think that's about it. I don't want to sell this to him. I'm gonna save that one for something else. So let me actually... Ah, come on, Pixel! Don't poop inside the house! You know that's not good. Bad boy! Bad, bad boy. Alright, uh, let me just store up the... Stuff in here that we don't want to sell or eat by accident. And next up, let me also pet up the puppy because we are really, really close to finishing this up. Bad boy. You definitely do not deserve to be pet here, buddy, but I guess I got nothing uh, else to do right now. We are really close to finishing this up. And I'm pretty sure that the next day, once we start the day here, we are going to be able to finish it up. Come on. There we go. Just a little bit more and we should be done. Alright, well, while we're at it, uh, let me just make my way into town because we are kind of... We are kind of missing a lot of food right now. We don't really have any more food. So uh, we all know that the best way to grab food in this game is just to go at the supermarket and uh, simply steal it. Or even go at the uh, restaurant, at the diner, and uh, simply go ahead and uh, open up the fridge in the back and get free food without any issues. Because nobody's going to chase us if you do that. I mean, that's something I always keep on doing. Uh, a great, great way that I'm also doing here uh, if you guys didn't know, you can actually feed the puppy for free if you go in the supermarket, grab everything you want from him and simply give it to the puppy. Nobody's gonna say anything to you because you definitely don't have the stuff in your backpack and people just don't know that you uh, gave it to the puppy. Hold up, where's the dog? Hey buddy, come here. I want to feed you a little bit. Alright, eat this. Look at that, we increased our levels a little bit and a little bit more. And if you go out... Look at that! Nobody knows! Nobody's gonna say things! So that's what I really love about this. You can easily get yourself some free food. <laughs> Alright, I think that we actually uh, feed... Uh, I think that we cannot feed our puppy anymore. He's definitely full. Or at least we can definitely feed him, but he's not gonna give us any more XP. So let me just grab some free food from the diner. Again, Sasquatch doesn't really need any food right now, but I do want this stuff for myself. Uh, since we are gonna have to reset the day. Alright guys, thank you very much for the free food. I love that we can do that. And next up, let's just make our way to the newsstand. Or the newspaper actually, not a stand because this is not a stand. Alright, let's see. Give me another mission, buddy. What's he gonna give us this time? Uh, you've outdone yourself with this photo. Truly amazing. Oh, never mind. We never managed to uh, deliver this photo that we already had. Ah, interesting. Alright, well, at least we've done that. Uh, we can now easily just fast travel to the racetrack and get ourselves some sleep. Unfortunately, we don't really have a bed for the puppy in this house. I wish that we had a bed in every single one of our houses. Hmm, if only we had that. What the heck? This guy is not even noticing our new puppy. Seriously, buddy? What type of friend are you? <laughs> Alright, anyway, let me keep on doing a little bit of petting here. Oh, you know what? The levels are also going down as well. Man, you have to uh, really put a lot of work into your pet here, increasing its... Incre 
increasing its heart level here. That is interesting. All right, let me also give him a little bit of food because he is hungry. And I think we are going to be able to increase to level 2. Let's see. Man, we still need some more. Come on, buddy. Eat the jam. Eat the lettuce. Seriously, he wants more? Hmm. The lettuce here is not really increasing a lot, though. Yeah, this is never going to work. I think I may need to restart the day one more time here in order for this to work. Let's just see if we can we can do it. Ah, it's too early. Seriously? Hmm. Well, in that case, let me just make my way back to the diner. And uh, keep on giving ourselves some more food because there's not much I can do other than this. Alright, there we go. And also, look at the paper. <laughs> look at that. A Sasquatch near someone's tent and campfire after dark. Awesome. Alright, buddy. Come in. Let me give you up some food. And also while we're at it, you know what? Let me just steal up some oranges here. Why not? Uh, while we're doing this, we're definitely going to need a little bit of money here, right? So why not just grab some free oranges? Of course, because we're doing this one, even if we're going to be giving food to the uh, puppy inside the supermarket, we're still going to have to run away from the cops. All right, we got that. Let me also grab some snacks for him. There we go. Let me give you some snacks, buddy. I'm not sure if we can actually give him some more food here in order to increase his uh, heart a little bit. Ooh, never mind. That actually worked. Ah, unfortunately, we are completely done. We cannot give him any more. All right, buddy. Well, I guess uh, that's all we can give you for now. In that case, let me just make my way outside the store. Keep on running. Uh, trying to stay away from the cops. <laughs> I wish we could actually use the uh, puppy here to scare off the cops away from us. But that doesn't seem to be a thing. You're never gonna catch me, coppers! <laughs> Alright, there we go. So, we are done with this one. Uh, let me also change up my outfit here. I really don't like this outfit. There we go. We got the ranger outfit. And let me also make my way uh, back over here. Because we are gonna have to restart the day one more time. Alright, there we go. Unfortunately, it is rainy today, but that is okay. I wonder if we can do some uh, some digging in the site. What is raining? Hmm. I don't know. But of course, we are going to have to grab ourselves some extra food from over here. There we go. Unfortunately, we kind of forgot to grab some extra food for the puppy, though. But uh, that is a-okay. Come here, buddy. I need to give you a little bit of food here. Uh, let's see, what can we give you? Let me give you a little bit of cheese. <laughs> I love it that he's eating absolutely everything I'm giving him. Uh, you know what? Let me give you the patty. I think this is actually going to increase the health more. Yes, it definitely did. Let me give you this as well. And let me start petting. Come on, level 2. Is this going to go to level 2 or not? Hmm. What? It's not going up, though. Huh. Interesting. Why isn't this going up? Hmm. Am I supposed to give him a little bit more food here? Hold up. Let me give him more food. No, this is not going up. I got a little bit of health there, but it didn't go up. Alright, well, in that case, you know what? Let me make my way to the museum. Hopefully, we got this going. I don't know. Let's check it out. Now, I wonder if I'm going to be able to go to with the puppy to a training section somewhere in order to increase his uh, ability some more. I don't know. I'm a little bit confused here, to tell the truth. Uh, let me just go right over here. <laughs> Seriously, buddy, you got to go ahead and poop every single time you're exiting the vehicle. All right, let me have a little bit of chat with this guy. Let's see if we are ready to do our mission now. Hello, hello. Are you interested in helping me find some dinosaur bones? Yes, buddy, of course I am. Well, of course you are. Now, in my experience, the best way to find bones is by using a dog's nose. I can tell you're a dog, by, uh, a dog owner by just smelling you. If your dog hasn't learned how, you may need to shower it with affection. Shower with affection? What does it even mean? With proper care and attention, your dog will learn how to research in no time. 
How do we do that? Is there a new location somewhere on the map that we may not know about? Hmm. You know what? That may actually be a thing. Uh, let me just um, make my way. I don't even know where to go here. I don't know. Let's just look for a new place here that we can use in order to train our puppy. Because by the looks of it, we cannot really train him at the moment. Yeah, I most definitely don't see anything that we gotta do at the moment. Huh. Quite strange. Quite strange indeed. Alright, in that case, let me go ahead get myself some sleep then. And uh, I guess we're gonna have to see what we're gonna have to do next in the next day. Ah, look at this! I knew it! So apparently we had to go to sleep in order for my puppy to uh, upgrade himself. You've reached a new level, a relationship with Pixel. Your pet learned a new ability, searching. There we go, so that's how you do it. It can now sniff out items, hidden items on the ground, so you can dig them up with a shovel. After it's done searching, it will point in the direction of any nearby hidden items it finds. Keep searching in that direction, and once you're close enough, your pet will show you where to dig. You can tell your pet to search using the radial menu. Oh man, we finally done it! Now I'm pretty sure if the level goes down, it's never gonna go down lower than one, uh, than two actually, because we are at level two right now. Ah, oh, look at this, and this is the one. I wonder if we can actually ask our puppy here to look for dig uh, digging holes where we can find ourselves some free money. Let me see. Let me tell him to search. And while he's doing that, let me also get myself some food. Oh, you know what? I think I may need to get myself some more food from the diner because we are kind of out of food. Alright, and by the looks of it, my puppy isn't really finding anything. So, next up, let me make my way back in town by using the map here. Fast travel to the site. There we go. And uh, once we get into town, I'm definitely going to have to go back to the diner and get myself some food. And also some food for the puppy because I'm pretty sure he is also starving. Come on, buddy. Let's get out of here. I think I'm also going to have my puppy looking for some secret locations because, as you guys remember, I still have one more dig that... One more digging hole that we got to find. Uh, let me check and make sure. So, secrets found. 21 out of 22. So yeah, we definitely have... Actually, no, this is the secret cache. Uh, the one that we need is this one. Holes dug. 30, uh, 63 out of 64. So we definitely need to find one more somewhere. I don't know exactly where it's going to be. Uh, but I do feel like it is glitched on my end. So anyway, let me get myself some more food here. There we go, buddy. And I'm also going to have to give my puppy some food as well. But for that, I'm going to go into supermarket. I don't have to uh, give him this food. The puppy is going to have some free food from the supermarket. Easy. Alright buddy, come on, hop on in. We're just about to feed you, pet you a little bit, and uh, make sure we haven't lost anything in the town here. Let's see, so first of all, we are going to have to grab these two right here, because he definitely loves this the most. There we go, buddy. Let me also do a little bit of petting here, why not? Just increase his heart a little bit more. I wonder what's the max level we can reach with the puppy, though. Hmm. It must be maybe level 5 or something like that. Alright, let me also give you a little bit of food. Like this one. Good job. Let me also give you this one. And let me also give you a... Actually, I'm not gonna give you a patty. I'm gonna grab some more free food from over here. So let's grab three of these. There we go, buddy. Alright, let's give you this. Come on. <laughs> I love that we can give him free food and we don't have to worry about uh, the cops chasing us or anything. No, not that. There we go. This is what I want to give you. Perfect. Alright, so we are done with the puppy. Next up, let me make my way back to... Actually, before I do that, uh, let me try to tell him to search. Let's see. Is he going to find something on the side? Ah, look at this. It's show me that I can dig something around here. So maybe we are going to be able to find the last uh, digging hole. Hmm. Come on, puppy. Where are you? I want you to keep on looking. Oh, man. Maybe he's going to actually help us find the location. 
Ah, uh, dang it, I cannot see because he's standing there. Come here, buddy. I cannot see because of that. <laughs> Let me try that again. Alright. Aha. Uh -huh. So apparently we gotta keep on going this way. Okay, let's keep on going. Let's keep on looking around, I guess. I wonder where the last digging hole is. And again, I'm really hoping that it's not glitched or anything. Let's see. Is he actually gonna be all the way back here and I missed it every single time? Maybe it's hiding behind these trees somewhere? Hmm. Doesn't feel like it. Yeah, it definitely doesn't feel like it. Don't see anything hiding behind these trees. Alright, buddy. Come down here and tell me again. Where is the last hole that we gotta dig? Uh, search. Oh, look at this. What? He keeps on pointing around this way somewhere. You know what? I think I'm gonna keep, uh... Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep on believing that the hole that we had to dig around here... We definitely dug it in my previous episode, but for some reason... The game has glitched. Oh man, I'm not gonna be able to see, buddy. Yeah, look at this. He's pointing down here somewhere. So yeah, again, I'm pretty sure... We're never gonna be able to grab this, uh... This hole that we gotta dig here, unfortunately. So this one is forever gonna be glitched, unfortunately. Alright, anyway, in that case, buddy, let me jump on a vehicle here. Make my way to the museum. And, uh, let's start searching for some stuff in there. Why not? Alright, there we go. And look at this. Apparently, they've also paved up this place as we finished up uh, building the uh, museum here. Because previously, this was just, uh, dirt roads. That is so cool. Oh, you know what I noticed? I noticed that it doesn't really matter every time how many times we reset in the day. We're still gonna be fighting all these poops around in the world. <laughs> and you know what I'm gonna do? I think I'm just gonna leave these poops around and see if the world is actually gonna be filled up with, uh, puppy poop. <laughs> that would be really crazy. Look at that. He's gonna poop again. <laughs> and the next episode, I think I'm gonna come here and see if, uh, both of the poops are gonna be sitting there. <laughs> Alright, let me make my way inside the museum, and uh, let's also chat with this fella right here, with the owner. Uh, just so that we can start our mission, digging up some bones. Hello, hello, hello! Are you interested in helping up uh, find some dinosaur bones? Well, of course you are. Now, in my experience, the best way to find the bone is by using a dog's nose. Alright, so apparently our puppy is ready to start digging. Excellent! I think you're ready to start finding dinosaur bones. Use your dog's powerful nose to sniff up bones. Dig them up, then bring them back to me. The winds are always changing, every day, so your dog might not always be able to pick up the scent. Make sure to check lots of areas every day. Your dog will tell you if anything good is nearby. Hmm... You know what, I wonder if uh, we're actually gonna have to look for stuff... ...in quite a lot of areas, and not only in the dig site here. Interesting... Interesting indeed. Alright, let me tell the puppy to look for stuff in here. Let's see if we can find something. Maybe that thing that he is actually pointing me at uh, in the town. Oh, look at this. Exactly what I thought. So maybe what the puppy is pointing me in the town is not really a dug that we gotta dig. But instead is uh, something else. Maybe he's trying to point me towards a bone that we gotta dig. Uh, let me see. Let me get the puppy out of there. Uh, also, you know what? Let me change and get myself the shovel in hand. Let's see. Can we actually dig anywhere? I don't think so. Come on, buddy. Where's the bone? No way! He's actually digging for it! Are you kidding me right now? There you go, buddy. That is awesome. I was not expecting that. Whoa, what up? You found a cash key. Ah, so this is what we needed in order to open up the key at the bottom here. Are you kidding me? That is so good. <laughs> oh man, this is so good. So apparently we gotta go on specific locations and tell the puppy to look for stuff. Alright, anyway, let me grab the cash. There we go, buddy. Oh, this is so good. Alright, so apparently in order to grab this cache right here, you are gonna have to dig for a key that the puppy is gonna be able to find for you. 
There we go. We got 22 out of 22 caches. All right, buddy. Keep on looking for some more stuff. Hopefully, he's going to find something in here. Oh, look at this. Again, he's digging. He's showing us something. What is that, buddy? Good boy. Oh, man. The puppy is so useful now. I love it. Oh. You have found a sack of coins. Wait, what? So are we just going to be able to find money every single time by using the puppy like this? This is really weird. Let me tell him to keep on looking then. <laughs> this might actually be a really good strategy to make money in Sneaky Sasquatch. Aha. Uh -huh. So he's not able to find anything on this side, I think. All right, buddy. Come on over here. Try to look for something on this side then. Let's see. Maybe the wind has changed here. Yeah, so apparently he's not going to be able to find anything anymore. Uh, hold up. Let me try to go inside here. And see if the puppy is going to allow us to find some bones then. Come on, buddy. Find me some bones. Yeah, you know what? I think the wind have might actually changed. And we may need to change um, the area or reset the day maybe. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Uh, hold up. Before we do anything, let me check the settings here for a second. For a second. Okay, so the hole that we just dug and got that sack of coins is not what I really wanted. Apparently, this is uh, still 63 out of 64. Hmm. All right. Well, in that case, you know what? Let me make my way back home, get myself some rest, reset the day, and uh, keep on looking for some bones. In that case, I'm going to try to look for something on this side. If uh, still he's not going to find anything, then I'm going to back go back to the museum. I think he's going to find something. Hold up. He's definitely sniffing something. Aha. Uh -huh. So it's probably going to be around here somewhere. Uh, first of all, let me grab this. Come here, puppy. All right. Keep on looking for some more stuff. I love that we have this feature, though. Hmm. Still nothing. He's pointing this way. So maybe it's going to be on this side. No, he's not finding anything here. Huh. Man, do we really have to be spot on with our search here in order to find the stuff that we're looking for? Let's see. Oh, look at that. He actually found it. That is awesome. Let's see. Is this going to be a bone or just some coins? I have a feeling it's just going to be some coins. Yep, I knew it. So apparently we are going to be able to find sacks of... Oh! Oh no, never mind. <laughs> he was just taking a poop. Uh, let me just sell all the oranges just so that we get away from them. I don't want to have them anymore in my backpack. They are taking a lot of space. Alright, buddy. Give me money. There we go. And next up, let me tell my puppy to keep on searching. Come on, buddy. Give me something good. Huh. Seriously? Is this even randomized or is my puppy not finding anything because because of the winds? Oh wait, what? Oh, he's taking a poop. <laughs> I hate it when he does that and I keep on thinking that he's actually found something. <laughs> oh no, an irresponsible pet owner didn't clean up after him. Hey buddy, is this your dog? Nope. No, he's not. You better clean that right now or I call the authorities. Oh, wait, so if I don't clean this up, no way! He's actually calling for the cops after me! <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Wow, well, I was not expecting that. Alright, anyway, let's, uh, let's just make our way all the way at the bottom here. And keep on asking for the puppy to look for some more stuff that we can dig. Alright, there we go, we got a new day. Uh, first of all, before we do anything, let me tell the puppy to look for stuff. It is kind of raining, so I don't know if this is going to work for him. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it that this is not going to work for him. Alright, there we go. We are back in town. Now, apparently, my puppy has started looking for something around here. Look at this. He just got out of the car, and now he's pointing me this way. <laughs> Come on, buddy. I just got in town. I got out of the car, and the puppy started pointing me at 
some direction. I don't know where. Let's keep on searching then. Let's see where he's gonna tell me to look. This is really interesting that we got this feature actually. Aha. Uh -huh. So we still have to keep on going this way. Alright, well, I'm guessing he's trying to point me somewhere around right here. Maybe? I don't know. Come here, buddy. Keep on showing me. What are you trying to show me, buddy? Aha. Uh -huh. So still, we gotta go this way. Okay, buddy. Come on. Maybe we gotta dig at the prison something? Or maybe back here? I don't even know. But I guess we're gonna have to ask him again. Come on, buddy. Don't lose your scent. Please don't lose your scent. Alright, so he's now gonna ask me to... I knew it. So it's probably gonna be back here in the... Oh! Did you guys just see that? That freaking green car just ran over my puppy. <sighs> Thank God he's fine. <laughs> Alright, let me go over here. Come here, buddy. There we go. And let's see what he's gonna be able to find. Please, please find something in here. Huh. He's pointing over here somewhere. Where? What did you find, buddy? Keep on keep on looking. Keep on showing me. Ah, there we go. We finally got it. Man, please be a bone. I've been looking for this bone for so long. Is it a bone? Come on. Come on. It is! Look at that! So apparently, you are gonna be able to find all these fossils. Not in uh, in the museum area, but apparently around everywhere in the world. Uh, and I think it's gonna be random. I don't think uh, these areas are gonna be the same. Although I will do a test, and uh, eventually I will release a video on how to find all these dinosaur bones. But look at that! We just found our first dinosaur bone. And I'm really, really happy that this just, this just happened. Let me see if the puppy's gonna be able to find some more stuff in the town here then. Alright, so apparently we are done. At least on this section. Uh, let me just take the puppy with me. Because I do know of another area that the puppy wanted me to look at. So, let me just take the puppy. Oh, snap! Man, that guy in the freaking green car again. Seriously, dude. No, no. <laughs> Man, these guys are driving like maniacs. Alright, so let's see. Is, this, is the puppy actually gonna find something in here again? Hmm. Yeah, you know what, I think this is definitely randomized. So, let me get myself to a new location here. Uh, you know what? Let me go on the island. Maybe there's gonna be something on the island that the puppy may be able to show me. Come here, buddy. Come here because I need you right now. Let's see. Is he gonna find something in here? He is! Look at that! Interesting. Alright, come over here. And let's look for some more stuff on this side then. Man, I'm really happy to have this puppy. This is so good. Hopefully we are gonna be able to find another bone though. Alright, apparently we gotta keep on going around here maybe somewhere. I wonder if Pixel here wants me to go on this small island though. Hmm, that may be a possibility. Okay, so he wants to maybe go right over here somewhere. Come on, buddy. Search again. Hopefully he can find it. I knew it! Look at that! He got it! Awesome! Alright, buddy. Good job! That is a great job you're doing right now. Alright, let's see. Is this gonna be another bone? Please be another bone. Is he gonna be another bone? <laughs> it is, but it's not the type of bone that I wanted. Dang it! <laughs> he just found a dog treat. Alright, buddy. Alright. I got the idea. So, apparently you are hungry. Uh, you do not want any petting though, so let me just give you that bone that you just found. <laughs> there you go. Alright, well, uh, I don't think he's gonna find anything around here anymore, right? Maybe we're gonna have to come back here later on on a different day. Yep, he's definitely not gonna find anything here. Alright, in that case, let me make my way to the museum, deliver the bone to, uh, to the owner, and see if we're gonna get something in return out of that. Uh, also, while we add it, is my puppy gonna be able to find something around right here? Huh. He's definitely sniffing. Ah, look at that! There is something here. I'm 
pretty sure it's not gonna be here. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to go... Oh, never mind. He found it. Ah, oh, there you go, buddy. Good boy. I'm gonna give you a great treat for that. <laughs> Love it. Alright, let's see. Is this gonna be a bone or not? I have a feeling it's not. Come on. Just some coins. Alright. Good boy, either way. I'm still gonna give you a good treat for this. Uh, so let me give you, first of all, a pet, because we did reset the day. <laughs> Good boy. He loves it. He definitely loves this. Look at that. Alright. Come on. We're done. Almost done. And a little, pet, a little bit of pet on his head. A boop. And we're good. Uh, let me also give you the treat that I promised. A fish. Look at that. This one fully healed him. <laughs> that is awesome. Alright, well, in that case, let's just make our way to the museum. Try to deliver the one bone that we found. And, uh, again, see if we're gonna be able to get something in return out of that. And before we do this one, actually, let me also check down here with the puppy. Come here, buddy. Let's just check down here one more time. I'm still hoping to be able to find the bone in this section. Let's see. Any luck? Nothing. Alright, so just as I said, apparently you are not going to be able to find the bones in the dig site here. But instead, you are going to have to look around everywhere in the world. Uh, so, first of all, let me just go ahead and uh, get this one delivered. And see what's going to happen here. Hello again! Have you got any dinosaur bones for me? Whoa, you found one! Let's add them to the skeleton. Oh, look at this! No way, so apparently we are going to be working towards building ourselves a full T-Rex here or something like that. Only 13 left? Are you kidding me? So apparently there's going to be 14 pieces of bones that you got to keep on fighting. They are going to be scattered around the world, that's for sure. So it's not going to be easy to do. Oh man, that's going to take a lot of work. But you know what guys, I think uh, this is where we're going to have to end up this episode of Stinky Sasquatch right here for now. And when we come back in the next one, we are definitely going to focus on trying to find all these pieces. And uh, eventually build our T-Rex or whatever we try to build here. But anyway, once again, thank you all very much for watching another episode of Stinky Sasquatch. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, a like would be very much appreciated as that's a great way to support the channel. And in the meantime, stay safe out there guys. And I will see you all in the next one really soon. Bye!